Ali Satar's um, suit is really nice. So nice. I understand. It was not his best, but I would really still commend the dude because he went up there and if you understand, if you're the first performer, there's a lot of pressure and uh, sometimes the nervousness gets you. So still, uh, I appreciate his um, courage and his um, effort. A bit nasal, um, I think that was his intentional style in this song. There were parts where he was really nasal. I think so, he was nervous a little bit. Because this is AJL. Bangon. <laughs> Bangon is like get up, right? Or wake up. So, yeah, I really think he was a bit nervous. But at the start, I didn't hear any nervousness from him, guys. Only at that part when he was hitting the head tones. I know, he tried his best and I still want to commend him. It was really good. Oh, I can't miss this song. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot about it. Yeah, I know, it's his song. But I don't think that is his um, entry in this um, AJL. I think it's a different song, right? Okay. I understand he's, he's the youngest um, contender in this um, AJL finals, I guess. But the dude is, you know, is a rising star and should not be underestimated. Like, I heard his chest voice and I was like, at his age, he could pull that off, so let's watch out for him, guys. Okay, come on, this leap. I love how he delays the vibrato at the end. Healthy placement. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Okay, game on, yes. That was so good. He took it up. It's a beat. I reacted to this, right? Yes, I reacted to this video. I could remember bits of it, but not the total lyrics. I love that his entry is a beat, and he started off with the uh, prolonged extensions of, of notes. It was to remind people that he could also do that. What do you mean comfortable? <laughs> am I comfortable right now? <laughs> I am! Oh, love is 
exhaustion. Yes, his attire is really good. Here goes the wrap, guys. of that voice at the end, that high note that he did, it has a rock feel to it because of the texture. Oh my. Gosh, he knows. His tended note at the end, that's how you kill it. And again, I'd like to emphasize that he did a great job at the start. He was doing the extended notes and the slow pacing at the start. To remind people that he could also do that and his song is a beat so definitely he really needs to showcase what he can do and also the rapping part is refreshing. I don't think there are other contenders in this um, finals. Um, I'm talking about the song that has a uh, rap to it so that was really good. Yes, hello you guys, hello, hello, my kid's getting up intense too. <laughs> I know right? A lot of his fans I understand are, are younger people I guess. And that is really understandable because he's, he's the youngest contender and also he's a rising star. And I also want to point out that I've heard him sing ballads and he can slay it. And he's so young so he's still got a lot, a lot of time to improve his um, singing. So when he goes to like at the age of 30 I guess, he's really going to be really good. I'm telling you, so he's, he's the one to watch out for. I don't actually watch AJL before, but here I am watching. <laughs> Thank you, Ada Gokel. You should watch AJL. You're Malaysian, I guess. And it's just a nice competition. Live. Oh, thank you so much, guys. So, what else? So far, two male singers, young male singers, and they did a great job. So if I'm one of the judges, it would be, be really hard for me to, to, to choose if I don't really have the right background about music, even um, background about the instruments, because that's where they're going to they're gonna compete. And also to consider the fact that the songs have meanings, right? And it also would be affecting the... the the results of this um, competition, I guess, like how the songs were composed and what's the meaning of it and how they delivered it according to the right feeling, you know? I am waiting for Jacqueline as well, like, that woman is a slayer. Chanel is after this, are you? Kidding me? I'm not ready. Oh my gosh. There's a lot of great singers. Um. I'm just so sad for Ernie Zachary that she didn't make it. 
I remember it now because Shamel is gonna be next, and I remember they won last year's AJL, right? They they won best performance or best vocals, I'm not really sure. But it really slayed that. Like that was my one of my earlier videos for Malaysia, like the Aku Cinta over in Zakli. Shamel, that was really mind blowing. I don't even know them, but I was like. The dude and this girl is like extraordinary. They're hitting those notes that were like mind blowing really and I could still remember so freshly how they were going down the stairs. You know, that was a nice setup. And I don't know if it's the same for everyone else in that competition that year or only Ernie Zach and Chanel had. The, the stairs, but all in all, I really love their performance. Oh my goodness, either you.